It's the National Football League on EA Sports. And if it's in the game, it's in the game. It's the Seattle Seahawks and the Detroit Lions next on Madden Football. Coming to you from the venue that hosted the Super Bowl back in February of 06. Welcome to Ford Field in downtown Detroit. Today, we've got a good NFC matchup on tap between the Seattle Seahawks and the Detroit Lions. And a welcome in, everybody, with Charles Davis. I'm Brandon Gauden, and Charles, so much gets made about offensive comparisons. Here's a matchup where the defenses may just take center stage. Yeah, we're usually talking about guys scoring touchdowns. How about the guys who prevent them and change the momentum of the game when they take the ball away? I love those ball hawks in the secondary. People after my own heart. sails over the end line. So out come the Seahawks now for their first possession. And they're led out by their mobile quarterback out of West Virginia. It's Geno Smith. As I remember back in 2013 when he was drafted out of West Virginia, he was coming off a back-to-back 4,000-yard seasons for the Mountaineers. Hadn't seen as much game time in recent years, but at one point, a capable starter in the NFL. Come on, come on. Hey. Right out of the gates, here's Smith. Oh, it was hit at the line of scrimmage and intercepted. And he will bring it back. An interception return for the Lions touchdown. So a big defensive play there on the opening drive, no less, as they make the interception and bring it back to the score. And I think that's a signal for how this defense wants to play. They want to be disruptive, and you know they're going to take some chances. Well, sometimes it can burn you, but right there, it paid off. Michael Badgley on for the extra point. It's up, it's good, and the Lions lead 7-0. A heck of a play there defensively, getting the interception, navigating his way into the end zone for the touchdown. So they throw the pick six. They'll get another shot at it now as this one's in the air. And they will not get a chance to return this one as it's through the end zone for a touchback. Seattle's offense coming back onto the field ready for their second drive. Well, remember, they were just out here a moment ago through the pick six, so we'll see if they can take better care of the football this go around. Yeah, and sometimes, partner, I think it's almost better that you just throw the pick six and you come right back out on the field. You're not over on the sidelines dwelling for it for very long. You're not hearing everyone say, oh, yeah, hey, you'll get them next time. Hey, don't worry about it. And all that stuff just goes right out the window. You're right back out on the field with a chance to atone. Now he's going to swing this one out to his running back. Walker hitting the ball is out. And this is going to get out of bounds. So they will gain a bit of yardage on the play, actually, and they'll hold on to the football as well. Throwing on third down, Smith. And this is going to be incomplete. Two drives won't tell the story of this game, but you absolutely have to like how this defense has played thus far. They have yet to allow this offense to get untracked in this one. And here's Dixon to punt now as he gets this one away. And certainly not the greatest of kicks there. This one will be down inside their own 40-yard line. So now the Lions go on offense in a great starting spot. They're led onto the field by the former Cal Bear and the number one overall pick in 2016, Jared Goff. On first and 10, it's Swift. And he's free going down the left side. It's a foot race. Touchdown, Detroit. 
CD, look at this clock and score. We're well, less than a minute into this game, and they've already made two trips to the end zone. So that means that someone's confidence is absolutely soaring right now. There's almost no slowing them down. On the flip side, now you've got to get together. You've got to talk to each other. Make sure you stay tight, stay focused as a team. Yeah, it's a quick blitz, but you can get back in this game if you don't let it get away. Extra point by Badgley, up and good. And it's now 13 to nothing. Well, I'm not sure if they drew that play up to score, but it scored indeed. One play on the ground and into the end zone for six. The kickoff unit is out on the field, and they will send this one away. And no thought to bring this one out. They'll just go down to a knee, and they'll take over at the 25. A man who played collegiately over at East Lansing. It's Kenneth Walker to third. And he is met at the line of scrimmage, and he goes down right there. Gino down a throw. No, it's out. Smith lost it. And they'll have a short field to work with inside the 15 at the 13-yard line. What part do they want empty set there? No bats in the backfield. All receivers out in the pattern. And in this situation, you know what the quarterback has to do? Act as his own blitz control. Yeah, he's got nobody else there to protect. No one else there to protect, which means he's got to get rid of the football and absorb the hit, but not go down and fumble the ball. Right back to Swift again on second down. And he'll get into the end zone. Touchdown, Detroit. DeAndre Swift with a second touchdown opening quarter and the Lions are able to strike quickly to add on to their lead. Extra point.